Yo, I uh, go. Oh, I go on family, yeah, man. We're back with another reaction video now. Look, we're still on Spirit Box EP, all right? The Fear of Fear. So we are now on Too Close, Too Late. Now, I heard a lot about this one. I heard a lot about this one, man. All right? But as we go, we know that it's a storyline, all right? All these songs put together is one song cut in six different parts. Now, in each one, there's a message that she's putting out. So we're about to check this one out to see if we can elevate on in this like we normally do from the others, all right? Because we already found out all the, the patches and the, the connections from one to the other from the rest. So we're going to see where this one connects to the last one faded, all right? But before we do, man, Give this video a like and also subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. And even if you don't, we still love and appreciate you around here, man. All right? So let's just hop right into this, man, and check this out. Let's go. BTP Gums TV. Here we go. This one is going to be interesting, y'all. Let's go. feel alive again started with the fear of falling come on now she started this with a punchline right there i like that i like that so let's see where this is gonna take us man like i always say man let's see where this is gonna take us man Into an hourglass, voices in the void are calling. I ain't gonna try to spit out everything she's saying, right? I'm just making sure I'm understanding what she's saying. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's replay that part right there. Let's go. I feel alive Did she just said, can your heaven help me? Tell me I heard that correctly, man. Tell me I heard that correctly. Can your heaven help me? Now we know we know in the past um songs for this, she been talking to herself. Like she been talking back and forth with her inner peace. Alright? So is she still talking to her inner peace here? Like is she still talking to her inner self? Here, bro, or uh, is she open up now more? Cause she says she feel alive again, so that's mean she's out of that dream, and she's now actually living. So I wonder if she's talking to somebody now. You know when you turn to somebody for advice and all that, and they're giving you advice, so you turn to them and like, you think what you say is real? You think what you're telling me can that really help me out of, out of my situation? You know that type of way. That's that's deep right there. Yes, they drag me down into the dark. Uh -huh. Of it all, can you help me? Help me? Mm. This is the end or is this the beginning? Mm. There are strange things I've heard on the outside. Mm -hmm. Separated by an open door. Woo! There are stranger things I've learned from the outside and it's separated by an open door. You know what she mean by that? To me, she's saying like, that's a choice. You could either be in or you'll be out. That's a choice there. That's a window she's talking about there. You could go in, you could go out. So you choose your side. But she said the strangest things are on the outside. Meaning when she's living outside in the world, bro. 
even though she have nightmares when she is dreaming, she still see the worst of things outside living, man. Bro, she's taking us down a very long steep road here. I'm sorry, man, but her well, whole voice is just, I don't know, bro. It's hard to explain the incredibility of the ability she have with those vocals. I'm telling you right now, man. Is she allowed again to call it what she want to? Is she allowed to call it what she want to? Do she have a choice to call it what she want to, bro? Baby girl, it's all on you. It's all on you. Yeah, that decision is yours. That choice between living or dying, happiness, peace, sadness, pain. It's all on you. I can't make that decision for you. They can't make that decision for you. So you make that decision on your own. We ain't taking no faults here for you, all right? <laughs> Let's go. You realize there when she said, wrap me in my arm, she's hugging herself. That could, oh my God, bro. That could be her inner peace talking to her, asking her, man, just, just love me, man. Love me for who I am, you know? Is this what you want me to be? Uh -huh. Is this what you want me to be? Perfect and clean, but it will only be temporary. Come on now. That's how a lot of people be. Like, if you are around a group of people who only want you around who only feel happy when you're doing what they want because this is basically what she's saying it's not good it's not a good look all right that will only be temporary if you try to be somebody you're not it will never last it will only be temporary so that's why she's asking now this is if this is what you want me to be it will and then she's letting them know okay if this is what you want it will only be temporary because that's not me that's not how i want to live come on Oh my god. This is a story time. She's still asking and she's still questioning herself. Is this the end or is this the beginning? Bro, thinking back and um, faded, bro, because she said a lot in faded. And she also recommended, um, she, not really recommended, but she also said certain things in faded that are connected to what she's saying now. It really is one song split in six pieces, bro. This, oh my god, this is mind blowing. I know where I want to go, but mm. it's too close and it's too late this time. I know where I want to go, but it's too close and too late this time. What does she mean? Let's hear what she's gonna say next. 
But I want to know what she mean by that. It's too close, but it's too late. Did she make the decision to go after something, to go after her happiness too late, even though it's so close? Because sometimes things feel, seems close to you, but it's so hard to get there because their mentality, the, your mental state is still bothering you. It's still giving you doubt. Like, is that what you really want? Remember in the song earlier, she said, is this what you want? Perfect and clean. So she's still questioning herself. She's still questioning herself here, man. That shit is deep. Drama, bro. No. Come on. She's still in doubt, not really in doubt, but she's really fighting fear of fear, man. She's really having a fear because all this what she's saying right now is letting us know, man. She's still fear of stepping out into the light. I remember back in one of the songs she says that she used to be love in the light. She felt love in the light. But during that time period when she was happy and being loved, she sees some of the strangest things. That's what draw her into this darkness that she's in right now. You understand? So it's all connecting for real. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Wow, bro, the fear of fear. Bro, she's literally having fear of fear, bro. That's like a lot of mixed emotions. And to be honest, in life, man, the most important decisions are the hardest ones to make. They are the hardest ones to make. Come on now, bro. I can't wait till I reach the end so I can listen to all of them over, like, straight through, like, you know, because I'm already figuring out a lot of stuff that she's talking about. And I'm with her on this journey right now. Like, I see where she's coming from and what she's going through at this point. But there's still so much that she are uh, putting out to us that have us wondering and thinking, what if she was? Like she said, this is incredible, bro. Just thinking about all that I've already listened to, bro, and putting it together in my mind, this is incredible. I don't think I ever seen someone did this before. I don't think I ever see someone did this as an artist before. I'm being honest, man. But hey, the video has come to an end, and unfortunately, man, you know, I gotta go. But before I do, please tell somebody you love them, man. Show some love, man, and peace. Alright? Because I love you, bruh. And I love you too, sister. 
all right let's make a change in this world starting with us but hey i'm gonna catch you in the next one man peace